هي هو هي هي هو هي هي هو هي هي هو هي هو Greetings, I'm Chief Buffalo Hart. My name, Buffalo Hart, is explaining to everyone the importance of the heart energy. Now, in this time on the earth, we must all work together and open humanity's heart to the earth. Yes, the earth is our mother. And we must be connected with our mother through our heart energy. It is sad but true that many people who are walking on this planet now have closed their hearts to their Mother Earth. It is very difficult to understand why people would close their hearts to their own mother, Mother Earth. I use my power animal, the buffalo. The buffalo is a very significant animal for the native peoples, for all peoples. But the reason is because the buffalo has a big heart. The buffalo even allowed its members in their, its tribe, yes, the animals have tribes too, to be sacrificed to the white people in the 19th century for reasons that only have to do with self interest and greed. Yet the buffalo stood there and allowed herself to be sacrificed. The buffalo is returning. And the buffalo has a big heart. The, the buffalo has even forgiven humanity for the terrible evilness that was done to the buffalo tribes that walked the Great Plains of North America. I want to take a moment now with you to honor the buffalo, a symbol of the earth, a symbol of connection to the heart of the earth. Please picture the buffalo now in your eyes, a proud animal, and see the buffalo heart opening to you who are working with me to open the heart of humanity to Mother Earth. Hey, uh, oh, hey, uh, oh, hey, uh, oh. It is not too late to save Mother Earth. It is not too late to work together to open humanity's heart to its mother. Yes, you may think that this is a time of great polarization and even going backwards in many of the games towards a more pure, 
more honest and more balanced planet. But the heart can always respond. And sometimes it becomes necessary to be creative, to be forceful, to be loving, to be demanding. In showing people on this planet how to open their heart to the earth. I know that each of you are already opened, that each of your hearts are opened to the Mother Earth through the medicine wheel, through this tobacco ceremony, through the song, through the dance. I know that all of you are also excited about the chance to ascend, the chance to go and leave the earth. But please remember one thing. Even in your ascension, the basis of your ascension is in your heart energy. You must have a pure heart to enter the fifth dimension. And this basic pure heart energy is rooted in the earth. This is one of the basic teachings from the native First Nation peoples around the earth, that the spirit and spiritual balance comes when you are connected to your mother the goddess of all. Some have other names of the mother. But basically, it does come down to a heart opening. I ask you now, visualize, visualize your heart chakra and visualize a sacred place on the earth that you love and connect your heart energy to that sacred place now in this visualization, in this meditation. And let me say a prayer for all of you, O oh Father, Mother, Creator of all, we ask today for your guidance, for each of us to bring us the personal power, the energy, and the means for opening the hearts of all humanity to the Mother Earth. So that the ignorance that is spread over this planet be vanished and those who are acting out of ignorance let those people too those in power those who have control let them and show us how we can assist them in opening their hearts to Mother Earth so that a new balance that we all want, that we all need, and that what which is part of our mission to provide and to stimulate and to activate this heart connection. Each person no matter how hardened, no matter how self-centered, can still find in their heart the connection to the heart of Mother Earth. This is a big galaxy that the Earth is in. 
There are billions of stars and billions of planets in this galaxy. There are other star people throughout the galaxy. We have been talking, we know about these other peoples. But still, this earth is your mother, it's our mother. And know that we, of the ascended native peoples, are committed, just as our grandmothers and grandfathers are committed, to being spirit guides for the earth so that the new earth can return and be welcomed. The new earth with balanced water, pure air, great forests, pure oceans, and people living on the earth with open hearts to the earth. This can be done. This will be done. And I ask that each of you with your own power and your own mission, accept your role in the beautiful task, in the sacred task of connecting humanity in humanity's heart to Mother Earth's heart. And then there will be a great new era on this planet. I am the chief buffalo heart. All my words are sacred. Ho!